I could tell the world just one thing, it would be that we're all okay. And not to worry, 'cause worry is wasteful and useless in times like these. I won't be made useless. Won't be idled with despair. I'll gather myself around my faith. The light, the darkness, most fear. You guys are hiding. Yeah. And it ain't right. There you go. There you go. We have a good spot for the pool to check out the honeys. <laughs> I gotta sit like, for oh, this. Yeah. No, I'm serious. And I who mean, are the honeys? Uh, the honeys, the guys. Nice bodies. Okay. Do a push up. Okay, I never got this viewpoint. Okay, that's cool. We're like undercover with the bushes. We just don't gotta wear, you know, like leaves on the head or anything. <laughs> just like sit up a little bit, look. Oh, that was nice. Sit back down. <laughs> 
It's all good. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about with this. Take it to the island, right? I didn't know you guys rated them. There's a rating system? like a 1 to 10 basis. It's like look, personality, look. And that's it. <laughs> so how you get a 10? Um, uh, most of them don't usually don't. I don't think with any males anymore. <laughs> For them to get a 10, it's like they're only thinking with like one thing, so it's like one. For them to get a 10, they gotta be good looking and probably gay. So I'll say a name. You ready? You give me a number. They go back to normal. Don't talk to me like that. Okay, I'll say your name. You give me your rating. You ready? Yeah. Wayne Brewington. Wayne Brewington? Ah, seven, eight. Fairly good looking, tall, muscular build. He has a fairly good personality. He's very the only, outgoing. The only downside is it seems like he can be a little shy. He's not necessarily too talkative. So like seven, eight in between, depending on like where he's at and who he's with. She's picky. McCullough. <laughs> Oh, McCullough. I'd say a seven because he's very shy. He's, I, I'm he's gonna, good looking, but you he's know shy. What? He's not very outgoing. Looks wise, like, I'm going to go like six no, no, because no, he's a ten. smaller guy. No, 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 no. no, because McCullough, McCullough is seven. very... A seven. Sometimes he can be very he's, cocky. Yeah, he's he he very cocky. Yeah, he's very cocky. Yes. Very cocky. But as, as far as like personality wise, he's a shy guy. He's not a big talker unless you give him a couple. That's of why I'm saying yeah. seven. Yeah. So, like, but I would, he I would, him, He's just like quiet little thing. When yeah, you know he's there. But I wouldn't even rate him seven. I'd give him like a six. six. All right. Personally, well, that's yeah. my. Per I mean, he's a good looking guy, but he's just not like. <laughs> let's go. Let's party. He's ninety two. I need like someone that's gonna be like, all right, let's do something. Not let's, let's go, guys. What's going on? <laughs> So who's up next? What's the next? You give me a name. That was long. Cole. Cole? Cole? <laughs> oh. Alright, Cole. Allie, Allie, go Allie, ahead. Allie, you're ready to No. Yeah. Oh, Allie's yeah. 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 You said no. that. You gotta keep Cole ready. Alright, that's the game. I personally think... Nobody's looking. Look at her. <laughs> I think Cole's a 10. No. Why? No. I disagree. Okay, no, now you gotta argue. I give him no, alright. You gotta yeah. argue why I think he's a 10. If you can give him the 10, you gotta like give distinct reasons why he's that. He earned that. I mean, is he that smooth? Really? I mean, he's good looking and everything, but like, come on. He has no really good temper. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, that's his really fault. Temper. Okay, come on. So three of you. Let's do it. <laughs> How do you guys rate Mr. Valletta? Valletta? What is an awesome teacher. Yeah, I'd say he, a nine. As yeah, a teacher, the rock. As a teacher, I give the rock to that nine. You climb the rock. You climb the rock. Yes, oh, I maybe yeah. like a ten. He's good Are looking. You He's older. Got a good job. You know, awesome personality. I gotta wait for the bathroom. I don't know. Right. You gotta say something. You ready? Okay. Sorry, somebody rated you. Sorry, Mr. Williams. We almost won, though. You'll be proud. We made it to the semifinals, though. All right, but we check this out. While you were walking, both of you, some women were rating you, and you don't know it. So you get a chance to rate them back, okay? From zero to ten. Who? Right? They already rated you two. It's been two. What are we talking about? Well, you were sitting, and they were checking you out. All right. So check this out. Now. You get to go right back at it. All right. Ready? You have to pay money. Wait, I don't want. I'll say a name, and you rate the girl from zero. To 10 and talk about her because she talked all about you. Ball's going, Mike. And she doesn't know. I'm a Ready? Crystal. 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 No, zero. What's up, Steve? Uh, uh, why zero? 0.75. Point 0.75. Not even a one? Mike, I gave her a zero. How about you? Oh what are we, what right. are we talking about? What are we talking about? What are we talking about? Perhaps the girl from the down to 10. We'll, we'll two. We'll two. Why two? We'll I don't know. I don't know who we're talking about here. <laughs> I'm confused. I, I just threw out a number there. I gave her a point seven five because of an injury. Or injuries. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, next. Who's the next person? The next girl. You bet. You uh, Jody. Uh, can I ask what we were rated? No. no <laughs> You'll see it on the tape later. Uh, well, before Jojo gets over here, I'll give her uh, 7.5. 6. Ooh. Missed the bus. Oh, there's Jody. Do you know? Because... Because Jojo's right behind me. 
Oh, <laughs> 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 I don't know. What are you guys talking about?
best people that I've ever known, Mike Butler. He was funny, outgoing, and everyone liked him. We had so many good times snowboarding, partying, and just hanging out. He always seemed to make things better. It was just more fun when he was around. We all miss him so much, but there's nothing we can do to get him back. We lost him way too soon. All that we can do now is remember. Please remember, I will forever. Riding around and chilling all day. Unexplainable how much we all miss you. It's impossible to forget you. Mike was a good friend of mine, probably the best. When we lost him, it hurt us all. I can remember all the cool things we did, like riding our quads and going to parties and all the stupid things kids do. I can remember getting pulled over by a cop on our quads and Mike telling him a story to get us out of it. I wish he was still around so we could still do all these things and do all the things that we never got to do. Dear Mike, it's been so long since we've seen each other. Your hopes and dreams are being carried out through us now. I hope you're happy. It's been tough but we've all been there for each other. You've made an impact on all of us, thinking that it could have been any one of us making each day more valuable. It's not the same without your smiling face in the morning when you got to school or when you threw papers at someone in your class. You got to drive quads, but it's not the same. You never got to drive your own truck. Still, we all know that you're in a better place, probably living it up, riding through the hills in the truck that you've dreamed of, watching over us. We want you to know that we'll never forget you or your bright blue eyes. wrap up 11 years in a matter of 30 seconds. It's just not possible. There's the, all the fun times that you've had. Bike rides, walks, quadding, go-karting, relationships, everything you've been through together. And there's just no way to do that. Where would you be without all your friends? In a matter of years, you might go out of touch with them. But always remember, all the memories you always have will always be with you. And all the memories we have of Michael, will always be with us.
Another turning point, a fork stuck in the road Time grabs you by the wrist, directs you where to go So make the best of this test and don't ask why It's not a question but a lesson learned in time It's something unpredictable, but in the end is right I hope you had the time of your life So take the photographs and still frames in your mind Hanging on a shelf in good health and good time Tattoos and memories and dead skin on trial For what it's worth, it was worth all the while It's something unpredictable, but in the end is right I hope you had the time of your life Something unpredictable, but in the end it's right I hope you had the time of your life It's something unpredictable, but in the end it's right I hope you had the time of your life
Yeah, we have a little situation here. We've got some, uh, some cops that... that What do I think of the class of 2004? Uh, good times? I would say 99% good times. Um, good students? 99% of them. 
Will I miss them? A great deal. Okay, well, wherever you go, whatever you do, be well, be happy, be productive. Take care of yourselves. Thanks. It's peeling and stuff, man. You shouldn't stay in the sun so long. I was out in my boat on, um, on what day was that? Saturday, I was out on my boat, man. You ever hear Red Lobster? That was me, okay? I got cooked. It was awesome. What are you guys, what are you laughing at? What's so funny, Craig? Funny, Craig thinks it's funny? What? You should have been with me. What's this for? What are you, what are you, what are you doing this for? Look it. Look it. I'm the only one working. Why is that? It's May. The kids are all done. Why, why are they all done and I'm getting dirty? What's up with this? I've been doing this for 50 years. Okay. Maybe not 50, maybe 40. It doesn't matter. Why am I working? I'm getting dirty. They're in there having fun. You know? We should start giving out grades. You know what we should give out for grades? Okay? F. Okay? They can, oh, F. Yeah. F for fun. They're here to have Please fun. Excuse this interruption. You know? Okay, as a senior member of the Phys Ed Department, I'd like to take this time to say goodbye to all the seniors. And before I do, I'd like to introduce the rest of the Phys Ed team, which is Mr. Pizzano and Ms. Evans. So should I say something now? Yeah, you can say something. Uh, good luck to you guys. Uh, you know, keep it real. Come back and okay, visit Ms. us. Evans, we have some <laughs> Wait, hold on. I'm not done. Oh, go ahead. And, we miss uh, you. We love you. We had fun. What's this we stuff? Well, okay, he did. Paul okay. and I. Miss you. We love you. You guys are great. Good luck. Be careful. Stay safe. Peace. See ya. Bye. Hit it. Ready? Hit it. If I never see you again, I hope it's because you found success. Good luck, guys.
Yeah. We just uh, finished uh, building the bike and putting it all together. We got everything on. So now we're going to uh, go uh, start it up and warm it up and then break it in and then go test it. <laughs> go for a launch. Nice. <laughs> 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 One, two, three, uh, oh.